Good day and Namaskar. Today we're going to be taking a look at how to add MetaMask to Google Chrome and how to add the Kronos network to MetaMask. So before you start this, this is already assuming that you have a DeFi wallet on the Kronos chain. Once you have that and you have your secret keys, you should be able to carry on with the next few steps and use the MetaMask wallet for your purchases. So let's take a look. First, you want to head over to the Chrome website. Now, once again, you can use either Google Chrome or you can use the Brave browser. Personally, I choose the Brave browser, but that's why I'm going to run you through Chrome. Brave's already done for me. So we're going to go ahead and click download Chrome and we're going to wait for it to download. Once it's downloaded, we're going to go ahead and run it. Obviously, this will be a little different if you're running it from Windows. All right. I'm going to close that up. So we'll open up Chrome. Then we'll go ahead and click on the web store. And we want to find MetaMask. And it's right there. We'll add to Chrome. Add extension. And it's now installed. Now once it's installed, we can click on this little puzzle piece at the top and click on MetaMask. Then we can get started. Import your wallet. This is completely up to you if you want to improve MetaMask. At this point, you'll enter your secret recovery phrase. This will be the phrase you got when you initially set up your DeFi wallet. So you'll go ahead and type in all 12 words right now, and then you'll enter a password. This password is just to get into MetaMask, so it has nothing to do with any other crypto. Worst case, you'll lock yourself out of MetaMask, and you'll have to redo this whole process again. Now, since I'm not going to carry on in Chrome, I'm going to pick up the rest in Brave, where I already have my wallet. So if we click on Extensions, once you add your wallet, it should show up here. By default, it will likely be on the Ethereum mainnet. Even though you have a wallet on the Kronos blockchain, MetaMask will not pick up the Kronos blockchain by default. You'll need to add it. So you see I already have it. What you'll do is you'll add Network. That will bring you to this spot here. Now I'm also going to add this information in the description, so if you miss it, you can also retrieve it there. So now you're going to want to enter all the specifics of the Kronos network into MetaMask. So you'll start out with a network name, which is going to be Kronos. The RPC URL is going to be https colon forward slash evm.kronos.org. Your chain ID is going to be 25. Your currency symbol is going to be the crow. And then the block explorer URL, that's going to be https colon forward slash forward slash chronoscan.com. Now you'll see I can't add this because I've already added it, but from this point you'll press save and then it will be added. So the last stage you'll have to do, you'll go ahead and click on that puzzle piece again. If it's not already up, you'll click on MetaMask, then you'll click on the network and you should be able to switch from Ethereum to Kronos. Done. Now you'll see if you go through all your apps, it should be connected. So it's not a lengthy process. So if there's any reason you're holding back, it's super easy. You can just connect up your wallet and that'll allow you to use a lot of the decentralized applications that you wouldn't normally be able to use just through the Kronos decentralized app. So hopefully that helped you out. If it did, give me a like, subscribe, go ahead and share that if you know someone else that can help out. And if you have any questions, go ahead and ask in the comments and I'll answer what I can. Until next time, let's make that crow and let it flow.